This was only the beginning. Great, it's all on you. Don't change for the world. Make the world change for you. It's your life. Make the most of it. Because every second that goes by, I had to make a choice to myself. Stop doing YouTube or keep making videos. Here we are, one year completed of doing YouTube. Don't really know what date it is because I probably uploaded this on some random day during this week. LMA up. You don't care though. So let's just talk, recap, and look back at some of the crazy stuff I did and how I started off with YouTube before I got to where I am today. Yeah. Hope you enjoy and consider checking out some of my older videos after this. BTW, my name is Junior Carrier. That's all you're going to know for now. Enjoy. <laughs> okay, here we go. Surprisingly, I never really wanted to become a YouTuber. It kind of just happened like this. So my first official video of going into the YouTube world before I consistently started uploading was Crazy Dog Walk, I Lost the Dogs. Now, that video wasn't really my best edited version, but it's true what they say. You don't know what it is, so I'm just gonna say it. Ignorance is bliss. Because in my head, I thought that video was fire, all right? The video took place at my friend Ryan Eisenfeld's house where I was given the opportunity to walk his dog. One that needed a leash, and one that didn't. I took the one that needed it. It was fun at first, but then they started pulling me, barking at people, not making up their minds where they needed to go. I was getting really frustrated already. Many hours have gone by. And then all hell broke loose. <laughs> I realized there was a spider on my leg and freaked out, dropping the leash along the dog just enough time to sprint away from me. And long story short, I had to like dive at the perfect timing when the dog ran by me, grabbing his leash, not letting go in order to bring it inside. My plan worked and uh, that was pretty much the end of that video and the start of my YouTube career because that was pretty freaking fun. Really enjoyed that. Okay. This was only the beginning. My passion for making videos grew even more and I started to become more creative. Every video I made had to be better than the last one. Any idea I had became my vision. Whatever tools I could use to create, I'd use them. It didn't matter where I was or what I was doing. I had only a phone to edit and about 65 subscribers at this time, but I had a goal. Hit 100 subscribers. It took time, but I never lost sight of my goal. And guess what happened? Did it. Determination, get it. My confidence grew regardless of the numbers. I didn't care where my starting point was. I was determined as fuck. Next goal, 200 subscribers. Took some time, barely had any supporters. Didn't stop me from doing what I love though. I learned more about YouTube and promoting. During this stage, I started using social media to showcase my channel. Apps like Instagram and Snapchat, still use them to this day. Back to my channel. Becoming a vlogger was the first step to getting out of my comfort zone. Let me tell you, that shit, awkward as fuck. But I had to do it. Determination? Get it. I started really getting comfortable with uncomfortable when I went past my comfort zone when I walked through the woods at night with nothing but a flashlight and a phone. I should have died. LOL. Still alive. Fearless? Get it. But I wasn't fearless. During this stage, I was fearful. It's okay to be scared, but don't ever let fear control your life. This was only the beginning. Eventually school came back around and I had to make a choice to myself. Stop doing YouTube or keep making videos. This choice was inevitable because I knew a decision had to be made. I didn't know. Risk the chance of losing all my progress I worked so hard for by stopping or just take that leap of faith and keep on creating. The fuck you think this is? I chose creating. I wasn't just going to stop because I had school now. I barely pay attention in class anyways. Create your own path. My senior year, I kid you not, basically vlogged the whole year. Don't believe me? Here you go. You're wrong. Anyways, I benefited from this way more than I actually expected. I never thought my channel could grow so fast. 100 subs in a week? Crazy. But it wasn't over. As I continued to research and learn YouTube, I found out about YouTube Career Studio. Very helpful. Showed me my analytics and stats. Thought that was awesome. Now I can see how well my videos are performing. Finally learned how to make thumbnails? Still suck at those. Making titles? Still change them even after I already uploaded the video. I don't care. Trial and error. You fail to get better. Don't tell me you don't. That's what life's all about. When you fall down, get back up. It's okay. When they judge you, don't change. Same way. When you wake up in the morning, that's a new day. Only you control your attitude. So when life knocks you down, what will you say? You are strong. You are gifted. Talented. Everything you need to be great, it's all on you. Don't change for the world. Make the world change for you. It's your life. Make the most of it. Because every second that goes by, you can't get back. Think about it. It's not over.
Cause that's freaking awesome. I sign my death no what's hope. Wrapped around my neck, go rope. I don't got time for lies and jokes. You gon' make me go and cut a go hope. She with me, she don't fuck with truth. Whoa, I stop my heart, now it's bulletproof.